What's up, podcast fans? It's your buddy Adam, the PhD, the previously heavy dude, and this is a very special episode of the Million Pound Mission Podcast. Now, you're going to get to listen in as I do a one-on-one coaching session with one of my clients for my Transformation Reboot program. We're going to dig deep into their top transformation danger zones and come up with actionable steps they can implement right away. And you need to listen in and you can implement those same steps to get better results for yourself. Now, be sure to hang out after the episode to learn how you can do a free 10-day trial inside of my Transformation Reboot program. All right, let's dive into the coaching session. All right, Paula, welcome to your hot seat sesh. What would you like to cover here today? Well, I've uh, kind of been struggling. Well, it's kind of been an ongoing process with kind of, um, I've over the years, probably last since 2006, seven, I've uh, been like an exercise freak. I mean, I, it was constant two times a day. I just cannot get enough exercising. So since I moved here in June, I've just kind of like, I go about three days a week, you know, which is, uh, that's when I hit my iron and but I'm like, there's other mornings where I'm just like, no, nope, not feeling it. You know, I'll do my meditation and mobility. That's, you know, my focus this 28 days. Yep. So, um, but I just still, I'm just like, and I'm, I keep getting down to myself because I'm like, what is my problem? I'm like, I used to do this every morning, I get 430 every morning. I'm like, I couldn't wait to get to the gym. Yep. And now I'm like, what the hell? And so I don't know if it's just moving out here, living on my own. I, because when I did bodybuilding, I did bodybuilding shows. I had a coach. I had, you know, accountability buddy with me. T- and, and then I moved to CrossFit for, you know, six, seven, eight years. And, of course, you know, the commu- it's the community. Yep. And, in fact, when I worked at CrossFit, too, I was one of those who sent out emails. Hey, where have you been? Haven't yeah. seen you in a few days or a week, you know. And I was that person, you know, getting on them. And then I went into powerlifting, you know, had a coach, you know, and keeping on me a little bit. And then I move out here and I'm on my own. I'm like, I cannot find that internal motivation that I need. Yeah. You know, it's just like, what is my pro? So I keep getting down myself. I'm like, and I get more and more down because I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> so, yeah. and you know, I know I work three out three days a week is, you know, and I'm like, oh, okay, you know, on my days off, like Tuesdays for sure. And Saturdays, Sundays, but those other mornings I'm like, so I don't know. I'm just kind of getting more, I, I shouldn't say depressed, but just more frustrated. Yeah. You get in your head about it. That's the way I was. I mean, I was like, and my nutrition has been good. Yep. It's just that, and I, yeah. So well, I, I think let's un- unpack this a little bit. Like it's, it's super <laughs> common what you're going through, especially with people that have been competitive from a like athletic standpoint, whether mm-hmm. it's like endurance sports or strength sports, mm-hmm. you know, I used to do strength sports right there with you. And I still feel that man, like the glory days syndrome, you know, like what I used to be able to do and what I used to be able to lift. And, and it like, it's hard to not Mm -hmm. feel like, well, like, like you said, like I used to go in five days a week, no problem. Yeah. But but we have to understand was like, that's however many years ago and it's a different you now. And I'm thinking back now, like, damn, that was 20 years ago. I was doing that stuff. That's crazy. You know, that's, or that's 15 years ago or that's, you know, whatever. And it's just something where we have to realize that, we're a different person now. Like we can celebrate the glory days and be proud of those accomplishments. And, and you know, like, that's a feather in our cap, but we can't necessarily hold ourselves to the same standard because of, you know, we have different adult responsibilities. You know, you've moved, mm-hmm. your job situation is, has changed. Mm-hmm. Like I've got kids and stuff now, so I can't go and spend like, I used to spend like five hours at the, the gym at yeah. one time, you know, and yeah. like I would bring food. That's how long I was at the gym for. <laughs> I'd be like, work out, and I'd have to get a meal in during the time that I'm at the gym. Uh, so, you know, it's just different now. So we have to kind of allow ourselves to just be like, okay, I'm, I'm proud of that. That was the, the me then. Now this is the me now. And mm-hmm. I feel like, you know, the 28-day cycle routine that we have with Reboot is good for you because you can just take it 28 days at a time and say, okay, in this 28-day mm-hmm. cycle, like you said, my, my focus point is like the, the meditation and the mobility, and that's what my body needs right now. I'm listening to my body. Mm-hmm. And and we're just going to drill in with, with this 28 day cycle and we're building momentum. You've got some injury stuff going on, you know, things like that. So, you know, each 28 day cycle, we can create a little minute shift in your focus that will get you back 
towards it won't be the same as what it was before but we can get you know shifting back towards that we've talked about you know getting your your body fixed up and, and things like that right. Uh, right. but the cool thing is we know a formula that works really well with you and, and this is something like there are three things that i feel like people are really across the board missing uh, from their overall game plan, that's uh, accountability, that's community, mm -hmm. and that's a rock solid game plan. Like you just mm -hmm. described those three things of like, mm -hmm. when I was really vibing with my fitness, these are the things that were going on. So mm -hmm. we need to look at like, you know, something like the, uh, you know, in the, the place that you know, you're going to be there for a while now, right? Like, yes, so, yeah, three years. Yeah, I'll, I'll be here in California for about three years. So yeah. we know that your new normal will be like this for the next three years. So right. let's find you a community. Like go in, like you're in California. Like there are fit people everywhere. <laughs> I, I know. I, exactly. I've seen the palm trees in the background of our video <laughs> chats before. So, um, it, so you should be able to find some some like minded, health conscious people. So go and try out some different gyms. I know you're kind of already doing that, but mm -hmm. like find something that, that vibes with you, make friends. You're a very friendly person. I have no doubt that you are good at making <laughs> friends. Uh, so, and, and then maybe you find a, a thing to do. Maybe there's like, uh, like a rowing competition or something like an indoor rowing competition or something mm -hmm. that you could rock at. That's still knee friendly that you could handle. Like just start searching out those things so you can get some competitive juices flowing. Cause you will do better. I need, that's a, what I know. You need a yeah. thing to compete for. Yes to get yes, you out of yes. bed and you yes. need a, you need a community and you right. need a, you need a coach. And obviously I'm coaching you through like the overall process, but you need to pick mm -hmm. a thing locally and be like, this is the thing I'm going to train for. And this is my posse. And these are the people I'm doing it with. And here's kind of someone that can lead me through it and, and hold me accountable to it. And that's the recipe mm -hmm. for success across the board with fitness. So, um, Amen. I love it. I love it. That's what yeah. I need. Yeah. So, I mean, what do you think? Like, obviously, there are things like those indoor rowing competitions. I know those are mm -hmm. going on. Uh, obviously, mm -hmm. I don't think, like, a, a full-on CrossFit competition would be a good idea with your no. your, your knee situation no. and, and all that. Right. Um, you know, like a bench press competition, totally. Yes. You could You could rock that. Um, mm -hmm. You know, something along those lines that's going to be knee-friendly that you mm -hmm. can still train for, um, mm -hmm. you know, and and get after it and from that perspective, I think. And then just start, like, just do a Google search. So that's your homework. I want you to okay. Google your area, uh -huh. uh, find different fitness centers, gyms, you know, start making some, some phone calls or emails and be like, you know, I'm looking for more of a, like a, uh, you know, I wouldn't necessarily say a competitive environment, a supportive environment that I can, you know, that'll kind of drive me forward. Uh, maybe do some free trials, you know, and just kind of shop around a little bit and then also look for competitions in the area maybe there's an indoor rowing competition that you find and you're and you can call these gyms and be like hey i want to train for this do you guys have any members that are either training for this or be you know interested in getting a group together you know mm -hmm. things like that and just you know start asking around at work and and just kind of network a little bit and you'll find you'll find the I stuff love, i love it yeah. i love it thank you adam that's but, yeah. uh, great advice well and the key thing is though we don't go out of the boundaries of what your body is currently <laughs> capable of <laughs> all right, I'm Paula. In type of girl when I find it. I know. Like, right, <laughs> so what I'm, the only thing I'm worried about is you going like, "There's this <laughs> rowing thing," but then they also do weighted lunges or like this strong woman contest where I'm just gonna blow my knees out completely. Like we want to postpone the surgery to your knees as long as possible, <laughs> and not just be like, well, "Let's just blow these suckers out." And <laughs> you know me so well. <laughs> I do know you. So. What I would uh, like, I, I would like, I don't need final say, but I would like input to be able to provide input. Okay. Like, just bring me a few competitive ideas, and I'll be okay. like, eh, this might, this might be better than the other. So let's just work okay. together on finding something that fits your body right now okay. that we can safely train for and keep you motivated, and, and we'll, we'll get it. you a crew. And you know, whatever connections, what what area of California are you in? I'm in uh, San Jose, Palo Alto area. Where so is that? South of San it's uh, about well, 45 minutes south of San Francisco. Okay. So I'm in the central Central Bay, Palo Alto, Silicon okay. Valley. Okay, yeah. cool. I'll ask yeah. around. I've had a lot of podcast buddies in, in California that are, are fitness okay. people. So yeah. I'll, I'll ask around. Area. Yeah. So, yeah. But you're above like Los Angeles and all that, right? Yeah, it's about five hours north. Okay, okay. Yeah. That's good to know. Uh, yeah. Cool. So yeah. Excellent. So yeah, I love it. I love yeah. it. I'm just, I miss that competitive so, something to train for and to eat and 
So I think that's my funk. Even out here, I don't know anybody. I, you yeah. know, I'm not really much of a global gym type person. I kind of like the smaller. Yes. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Rough and tough and, and uh, yeah. gym. <laughs> Sweat and <laughs> so, so. growl and. Yeah. 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 Weights banging. And, yeah, so, so, yeah, you would love my gym, Paula, but it's. it's I know <laughs> I would. I know. I see your videos. I'm like, oh. <laughs> so like I wish I was there. Yeah. We'll, we'll get you there someday. Yeah. Um, yeah. Now, an, another thing to consider is like if a gym has a good like body transformation challenge or something that you could get in plugged into also, mm -hmm. like those mm -hmm. are always fun. But yeah. same on the same level, I want you to be conscious of your mindset. What we don't want is like I'm all in for this eight week challenge and then like I, I yeah, we crash and burn after that. So yeah. We mm -hmm. use it as, as kind of, just kind of a spark, but not the entire, that's not your entire source of energy. Does that make sense? Yep. Okay. 100%. All right, cool. I know I've kind of moved away. I mean, the scale is important to me. It always has been, always will be, uh, the numbers on the scale, but I'm trying to move away from that yep. and, you know, just it's all in the mindset and just yeah. plug away and one week at a time and just, I want to be happy with yeah. who I am and, uh, you know, just, uh. I know I got more things to offer than just my weight and, yeah. you know, my, you know, so, yeah. um, or yeah. if you, if you find a local gym that does like a, a money prize challenge, like let's, let's go win you like 5,000 bucks or something. And I'll, I'm, I'll be your secret weapon on that deal. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, liking it. I'm liking it. Imagine how many keto bricks you could buy with that. You know, Man. I just went on the other day and they were sold out. So I, I, you know, hopefully he's getting ready to release another batch. Good. So yeah, I, I just got the email. So, uh, um, yeah, if you Good. go to ketobreck.com and, and fill in, he'll okay. send you like one email a week with some tips and then he lets you know okay. when, when he releases. So Perfect. they're, they're delicious. Uh, I'm trying to get Robert to do like a Willy Wonka, like golden brick, <laughs> you know, like, oh, a, perfect. yeah, yes, yes. I'm like, you should do one golden brick, like every six months, just put it out there. And then yeah, like, whoever gets the golden brick, they have to, like, <laughs> they, they sing like the Willy Wonka, like I've got the golden brick. <laughs> And then uh, he like brings him in for a workout or something, you know, like something. Oh, that like would that. be awesome. Where's he? Is he from He's Arkansas? Arkansas, yeah. Right, right. I'm like, I don't. There's an accent there. I don't like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, yep. uh, yeah. Okay. Cool. He was actually yeah. just out in in San Francisco, so uh, oh. Oh. you missed him. The Metabolic Health Summit was going on. Okay. So anyway, well, uh, yeah. So do you feel like like as far as action steps, are we, are yes. we clear? Are we good? Yes. I'm going to, I'm off today. So good. I'm, that is my goal. Yeah. Just do some research, something. send mm -hmm. some emails, do a few calls, just check in with mm -hmm. local gyms, like, and mm -hmm. ask them like, are there any, you know, any like bench press rowing, you know, knee friendly competitions right. you know, that, that we can get plugged into. So, you, so the check marks we're going to make is find a community, find a competitive thing, find, mm -hmm. you know, some sort of coach or people to be accountable mm -hmm. with. And then I'll help you put a game plan together. And that's, that's what I love to do. So you cool. rock. Hey, thanks for hanging out for a minute after the episode. I hope you got a ton of value out of that coaching session. Now, if you are ready to reclaim control over your health and be a part of an amazing community and support system, I want you to head on over to millionpoundmission.com and start your free 10 day trial inside of my transformation reboot program. Now, as part of this program, you get to do monthly one-on-one -on -one strategy sessions with me just like you heard here today. We also do weekly small group support sessions, monthly deep dive discussions, and the daily interaction and support you'll get inside of our community page is unlike anything you have ever experienced in your fitness journey. Now, I know that you're probably somebody that is willing to put in the effort to reach your transformation goals. And if you allow me to add some structure, accountability, and support around that effort, you'll be able to gain amazing momentum and feel unstoppable. So head on over to millionpoundmission.com and start your risk-free 10-day free trial of the Transformation Reboot Program. My friend, I will look forward to doing your welcome video chat session soon.